It was the year 1941, and Japan's high school acapella team was on its way to winning the national championships and had already beat some of the country's best teams. Japan's acapella team saw the United States high school's acapella team as the only team that stood in their way, so they tried to infect the entire team with strep throat so that they wouldn't be able to compete, leaving four of their team members unable to sing. The captain of the US team found the source of their strep throat and vowed that they would crush Japan in nationals, starting the war between them. The US knew that to win nationals, they would have to prepare an amazing set before Japan and even before Germany high school did, so they put their expert arrangers on the job to create the set. Meanwhile, Japan started by competing with other schools in their region, and they won most of the regionals. To get revenge for the strep throat, the US sent a few people to steal some of Japan's sheet music. The US was only able to grab a few pages, but this made Japan's team feel vulnerable. It was now time for round one of the semifinals to begin. Before the US went on stage, Japan attempted to sabotage them by stealing their costumes. This resulted in the disqualification of two of Japan's team members. Japan was very angry about this, so they planned to fix the next semifinal by turning off the US's microphones before they went on. The US found out about their plans and made sure they wouldn't be able to surprise them like that. The US won this round of the semifinals, and many of Japan's singers had hurt their vocal cords trying to beat them and couldn't proceed to the next round. The US competed with and recruited numerous other teams as part of their strategy to hop their way to Japan's team in nationals. Then, the US also needed to win the late round of semifinals to give them an advantage for nationals. Japan's team had weakened, and they knew this was their last chance and they needed to win over late. They brought all they could, even forcing some of their team members to hit notes so impossible to hit that their vocal cords would be forever damaged, just for the sake of winning. But despite this, the US won the sing-off, and it was followed by many other victories. After quite some time, in 1945, the US had won many small competitions and they had enough support to move on to nationals at Japan High School. Meanwhile, the US's expert arrangers had just finished writing and testing the amazing set, the greatest set in the history of high school acapella teams. At this point, the captain of the US team had two choices. One, he could use the amazing set in nationals and cause considerable damage to Japan High School, or proceed to the finals without it and possibly lose. The captain of the US team decided to use the song. They did so well that the sheer power of the notes quite literally blew everyone away, causing destruction throughout Japan High School's auditorium. This destruction resulted in Japan High School eventually accepting their loss and surrendering.